Hi, long time no see. How are you today, Helen? You're happy. Okay, how 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 have you been last month? How's your examination? Um, um, oh, you could say result is bad. Bad <laughs> uh, I'm not. Study studied hard. Oh, you didn't so, study hard. Oh, yeah. it's okay. It's, you still have a next time, right? <laughs> I still yeah. next time. Me too. What I'm I'm like that when I was in college. I don't study, <laughs> and <laughs> when the results are bad, I regret. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, when is your vacation? Um. Oh. Oh, jolly July, July, uh, July. July. Yes. Oh, so you're already on a vacation. Uh, nineteen. Ah, nineteen. 19. Eight days ago. Ah, uh, eight days to go. <laughs> yeah. Okay, eight days to go. Okay, so you will have how many days of vacation, or how many months? Uh. Two months of vacation? Uh, yes. Oh, wow. And then when you go back, you will have a new set of teachers or still same? You will have what? a new teacher when you go back to school or? Uh, same, same teacher. Ah, same teacher. Are you changed teachers when after winter vacation, right? Uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. Anyway, how's the weather there today? Um, sunny and so hot. Sunny and so hot. So no rain today. Uh, no rain today. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, how about did you already eat your dinner? Oh uh, yes. Yes. What did you eat for dinner? Um, ramen. Uh huh. Ramen, so it's in Japanese. Uh, noodle soup. Oh, okay. And then no more. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay. Anyway, it's I'm happy to see you again. <laughs> uh, me um, too. Okay. Thank you for that. Okay. Are you now ready to have your lesson for today? Yes. Yes. Okay. So we'll just go back to where we didn't. Uh, where we stopped. Okay, so let's have mm, this one. Oh wait, uh, did you watch um Inside Out movie? Oh, yes. One and two. Uh, one two. Oh, one and two. Oh wow, who's your favorite emotion? Um, who's your favorite? Uh, hmm? Who is your favorite? Uh, Taboni. Taboni is. Oh, what is his or her color? Um, purple. A purple. Yes. Is it the one using a purple cell phone? With cell oh, phone. Yes. Oh, <laughs> okay. Her name is. And we in English, and we all oh. oh, that one. Okay, I like um, hmm, I like the pink one, the big oh. one. Oh. <laughs> Embarrassment, I like him, he's so cute. <laughs> 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 yeah, okay, so you like the two. Uh, you like which one do you like more? One inside out one or inside out two? Uh, one. Oh, you like one to me too. Yeah. I like one. <laughs> I hate the orange one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, anyway, the reason why I uh, ask you about them is because our lesson is about ta -da! thoughts and feelings. Okay, so we have here like anxious, we have anxiety, we have 
Envy? Envy the uh, little one? The blue uh, yeah. with green? Yeah. Okay, what else? We have sorrow for sadness. We have, hmm, what else? Temper or what they call that one? Anger, the red one, right? Mm. Uh huh. And the more. Uh, disgust, the green one, the green girl. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> we will have that here in our lesson. Okay, so let's have the first word. Okay, what is the first word? Mood. Yeah, mood. Okay, can you please read the sentence? She was smiling and I felt my dark mood slowly lifting. Uh -huh. Okay, so what do you, do you know what mood is? Uh, feeling. Uh-huh. It's the way, the way... You feel at a particular time, right? Uh, mm -hmm. It's like, what is your mood? How about today? What is your mood today? Or maybe tonight? Like, is your mood like, are you in a good mood tonight? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. How about also, so mood is the way you feel at a certain time. A certain or a particular time. Okay, how about moody? Do you uh, know what moody is? Uh, no. No, moody is um someone. Oh wait, someone who changes um their feelings quickly. Or often, okay. It's like when 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 other mm -hmm. people tell you that you're you're such a moody person. It's like you were just happy like for two minutes, and then after two minutes you're like angry, and then you're sad. That that is moody. Uh huh. It's like you change your mood in a very quick way. Uh huh. Are you a moody person? Oh, little. <laughs> a little. <laughs> Me, yeah. I am. I am a moody person. Most especially when I'm in my period, Ara period. Like the girls oh, have. Like, uh, 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 yes, I know. Yeah, every time of the month, right? Uh, yes. Like every month. <laughs> We're moody, <laughs> right? Oh, and we have that. Okay, you know mood and moody now? Yes. Okay, very good. Now let's have, what's this? Sorrow. Yeah, sorrow. Okay, the mm -hmm. other word for that is grief. Okay, can you please read the sentence? Pools, uh, pools co colleagues. Colleagues mm -hmm. expressed deep Ex sorrow. Mm hmm expressed deep sorrow at his tra target death. Uh, this one is tragic. Uh, tragic. Okay, and this one expressed. E expressed. Okay, very good. So, do you know what sorrow means? Uh, sad. Yeah, okay. When it's sad, but it's um a feeling of deep sadness. Okay, you're not you're not just sad, but it's something deep. So it's it's what you call sorrow. Okay, got it. Yes. Uh, how about sorrowful? Uh. <laughs> sorrow. It, it talks about the person, so it means like um feeling. Or showing deep sadness. So it talks about to uh, it talks about the person who feels uh sorrow. Like she's very sorrowful because she's showing deep sadness. Uh, mm -hmm. other people can see that she's uh, feeling 
that deep sadness. Okay, you get it? Yes. Okay, very good. Now next, let's go to the next one. Emotion. Uh -huh. We have feeling. Okay, can you please read the sentence? I feel the emotions of joy, sorrow, hate, and love in the book. Mm -hmm. Like in the movie, right? We have joy. <laughs> um, sorrow is for sadness. Hate? There's no hate yet. And there's no love yet, right? We only have... Hmm. Oh, I, I forgot the... The old one, the, the emotion that is very old, the granny. Can you remember her? Like she has her glasses and then she's very old. Uh, uh, memory, Kramer. Oh, yeah, memory. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, now I remember. But she's not in here. Okay, so when we say... Emotion, what is it? Uh, a feeling. Oh, yeah, it's feeling. Okay, feeling like... um, Feeling like happiness, sadness, or anger, right? Okay, how about emotional? Uh, uh. Person feeling. Mm -hmm. When when we say a person is emotional, she's she or he is having strong feelings. Uh huh. It's like um, uh, when someone dies, and then I will say I'm very emotional today. It's like I I cry a lot, and um, I can't stop crying. Because I'm having strong feeling of uh, sadness like that. Okay, I'm very emotional for today. But when, when they say very emotional, it talks about like uh, crying like that. Uh, you're, I'm very emotional today. Like I feel so much. Yeah, they, they use that in a sense. Okay, you get it? Yes. Uh, am, am I fast? Or is oh, no. oh, no. Okay, very well. So let's have next one. What is that? Anxious. 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 Uh -huh. okay, that is the orange one. Uh, yes. <laughs> okay. It, it, it's also uneasy and eager. Okay. Can you please read the sentence? As a date of my op operation. Uh -huh. Came up, I become more and more anxious. Okay, I became more and more anxious. Okay, do you know what anxious means? Uh, uh, mm. Okay, anxious means feeling worried or nervous. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay, when... The orange one. I, I don't know what is his or her name in Korea. The orange one. What what do you call her or him? Uh, pur, purani. Uh, purani. Okay. So when she takes over Joy, uh, Ray, Riley, like the other emotions are not there, right? Like it, they're, they're thrown away. The joy, sadness, anger, right? They're oh, thrown yeah. away. And then uh, anxious is like she's feeling worried or nervous about Joy's, uh, Riley's future, right? Mm -hmm. That's why she's feeling that way because that is her as an emotion. She's feeling worried or nervous about something. Yeah. Okay. And then how about anxiety? Uh, worry. Oh, yeah. So if this one is you're feeling worried, anxiety is what you call is the feeling of being worried 
or nervous. Okay? So, anxious is the feeling. And anxiety is the way you feel. Like, the way that you feel nervous or worried. Okay? Mm -hmm. Get it? Yes. Okay. Next one. Ashamed. Mm -hmm. Ashamed. Okay. The opposite of ashamed is opposite. The other way around is proud. Okay. When you're not proud, it's ashamed. Okay, Ara? Yes. Okay. Can you please read? She felt ashamed of herself for trusting, trusting. Him, trusting him blindly. Okay, when we say ashamed, what is it? Oh, feeling shy. Mm -hmm. Feeling shy or more likely feeling um, bad, right? Because mm -hmm. maybe you did something wrong. So you feel shy because you did something wrong. You feel bad. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, there's no... Is there a... Mo ah, this one is embarrassment. The pink guy, like, with a hoodie. Hoodie? <laughs> yeah, this one. This is him. <laughs> okay, that is embarrassment. Okay, and then, how about be ashamed of or be ashamed at? Uh... Mm. Mm -hmm. So this one, be ashamed of or be ashamed at is um, to feel guilty or embarrassed, embarrassed about something, okay? Oh, what is embarrassment's name in Korea? The pink one, the hoodie with hoodie. What is his name? Oh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, you you don't know, but that one is him, because like he always hides because he's so shy and he feel bad for something, right? But he's still good, right? When that's why he helped sadness, the blue one, right? When she got got back, okay, it's good that you watched uh, Inside Out too because we can relate this to this one, right? <laughs> okay, so this one is what is it? Depression. 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 Okay, what is that? Can you please read? She sank into a deep depression. When her grandmother passed away. Okay. When you say depression, what is it? Uh, become sad. Mm -hmm. Okay. If there's sadness, level two of sadness is sorrow. Level three of sadness is depression. When we say mm -hmm. depression, it's like it's a high form of sadness. Okay. When we say this one, feeling of deep sadness too but that uh, lasts a long time mm -hmm. okay when maybe when you feel sad um, it will not last a long time it's like a short time sorrowful maybe let's say um, one to two days of being sad but depression is far away from sadness only it's a long time of feeling that deep sadness have you ever tried to feel that way oh uh, no okay, that's good it's <laughs> good that you don't know how the, how it feels <laughs> okay so that one is depression Okay, we have sadness and then sorrow and then third one is depression. Okay, and depressed. What is depressed? 
the feeling of the mm -hmm. it's like this mm -hmm. one depression, but this one is like I'm depressed, like um I'm feeling it's like the same, very sad for a long a long time. So this one is the feeling. Depression is what you call the feeling of deep sadness. Okay. Okay, great. So let's have the next one. Okay. This one weep. Is weep. Very good. It's like cry. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you please read? Fear not the true uh, for, for sure. future. Future and weep not for the past. Okay. When you say weep, it means? Uh, cry. <laughs> mm -hmm. Cry, but softly. Weep is cry softly. Okay, mm -hmm. and um, it's like when you lost a toy, the child wept because he couldn't find his toy. That's like soft, cry softly. Uh -huh. Okay, and we also have weep crocodiles, uh, crocodile tears. It's like an idiom. Okay. Yeah. Idiom. Yeah, idiom is... Some command. It's like um, a, a group of words that they always say, that people always say. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like it's not the literal meaning of it. Okay. Now, when we say weep, uh, crocodile tears, it's like you uh, pretend to be sad. Uh huh. Pretend to be sad. That is weep crocodile tears. So when they say you weep like oh uh, you weep crocodile tears, it's like a fake cry. Like she wept crocodile tears to get more candy. Like babies do this, right? Because like they do fake cries just to get more candies and all. Okay? That's it. That is weep crocodile tears. Pretend to be sad. Next is? Annoy. Annoy. Okay, it's like bother. You bother me a lot like that. Okay, and then can you please read? Uh, it annoys me when my little brother snores mm -hmm. badly every night. Do you know what snores mean? Oh, yes. Okay. Okay, do you know what annoy means? Uh, become angry. Mm -hmm. To bother or maybe irritate. Ara, irritate? Like, no. angry but a little bit. A little bit angry. Irritate mm -hmm. someone. Some... What? Let's just say it. Irritate. Irritate this one. Mm. Uh huh. Angry, but not that angry. It's just a little, mm -hmm. right? Okay. How about uh, annoyed or be annoyed with? Mm. Mm. That is the feeling of being mm. bothered or irritated. Okay. Like, uh, feeling. Of being bothered. That's it. Or irritated. Okay. That is the feeling itself. Annoy is to bother. To do it to someone else. Okay. Irritated by someone. So you, to annoy means you're the one going to irritate someone. But annoyed, be annoyed with. You're the one being annoyed. Mm. But yeah, okay. And then, get it? Yes. We have. Will, will leave? Yeah, relieved. Okay. 
Can you please read the sentence? We often eat the comfort to relieve our anxieties. 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 Like that. Okay. Anxieties. 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 Very good. Okay, great. Okay. When you say relief, um, like you feel something bad, but when 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 you relieve, it's like to make something uh, less bad or to make to make someone to make someone feel better. Okay? That is relief. Mm -hmm. Like they're feeling bad, but oh, like that. You make <laughs> someone feel better. Okay. How about relief? Uh, feeling relief? Mm -hmm. It's like um, uh, like they they say that oh it's a relief like they they're feeling something bad but it's like it's more like the feeling when something bad is gone or better so they're feeling bad right for for example they're feeling bad and then the reason why they're feeling bad is already gone or it's better. Then they will say, oh gosh, thank goodness, it's a relief. Like that. They use it. Okay? You get it? Yes. Your relief is like to comfort other people. Relief is the feeling. Okay? Okay, yeah. and last one, amaze. Amaze. Okay, we have surprise. The other word for amaze. Okay, can you please read? Julia amazed her friends by suddenly getting married. Mm. This one is amazed. Uh, amazed. Yeah, okay. Ara, amazed? Uh, being surprised. Yeah, being surprised. Okay, to amaze is means, uh, amaze is to surprise someone. Mm-hmm. Like a lot, like that, okay. And amazing is something very surprising. Oh, that's very amazing and maybe wonderful. Okay. Uh huh. Get it? Yes. Okay. So, uh, we will just stop here. Uh, we talked about one to, I guess, 10 words. Is it? One, two, 61 mm -hmm. up to, yeah, 70. Okay. So then, oh my gosh, it's already time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> do we have a class tomorrow? Oh, we yes. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. So since we'll have a class tomorrow, we'll just have a review with these 10 words, if you can still remember them, okay? Is that okay yeah. with you? Okay, thank you for today. How, um, it's nice to see you again. You did a great job. Okay, bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. -bye. Bye.